This is the 128S battery voltage alarm slash buzzer. I've already opened the corner of it. So it's just a small bag. Here's what comes inside. There's two of them in this package. There's one, and we'll leave the other one in the package there. So here's what comes inside of this one. As you can see, it's been uh, wrapped in um, shrink wrap so that none of the things get contacted. Uh, it's got points for eight, for an 8S battery. You could use even just a 1S. There's the loud buzzers. Let me get these out of the way so you can see better. So there the buzzers are. Here's the information on it. And again, a little bit clearer now, there's the points for up to an 8S battery. So the ground is on the bottom here and it goes up to 8S from there, positive. And there's a little push key that you can set the low voltage alarm. Uh, default is 3.3 volts. I don't think that's very wise. Uh, in RC use, you might hit 3.3 volts uh, under high current and then it'll probably have a resting current of 3.7. Um, that's, that's fine. I like to prolong my batteries a little bit longer, so I'm gonna try setting it for a little while here. Here is a Cheerson CX20 battery. Let's go ahead and plug this in to demonstrate it. Black is always ground. Let me show you. The black lead is always ground. And black is on the bottom here, so let's go ahead and plug this in. And you can hear it's really loud. 11.6 volts. First battery, 3.84. Second battery, 3.85. Third battery, 3.86. All of them total, 11.6 volts. And it'll cycle through. Now if I press the little button, it says 3.3. If I press and I keep pressing, it'll keep increasing it by 0.1. 2.7, all the way to 3.8. Or it'll shut the buzzer off. As you can hear, it's really loud. Uh, you probably hear that from very far away. So that's the that's the little voltage alarm. Looks like it runs pretty well. And uh, thank you for watching my video.